Hello there, this is Ben Fournier or Benevolent Satacorum and here's my post on two types of dispense conspiracies. Here I'm referring to the probable form of officially released PSYOP narratives of which I see two basic kinds. One, absurdities meant to cloud the pool by fallacy of composition, division, uh, lead to trust and authority by ridiculing speculation against whatever the status quo may be at the time, and two, near-truth information leaks with just enough wrong in the details or other things that factoid nitpickers can readily highlight the deliberate errors of and thereby pretend everything else must also be wrong by default. Absurdities would be like moon lantern would be like the moon landing hoax type garbage or other things that seem too far out because they are and yet within the niche of consistent lies they can sound convincing to those who want to think they are for whatever reason you know even though there may be some handful of true believers in them it doesn't make it a, a real one it's just it's a planted one that unfortunately got followers kind of thing that's how it seems to me Near-truths would be like speculation regarding how things play out in relation to the Agenda 21-2030 eugenics program, with some things being overemphasized or underemphasized for various cliques that get programmed according to what they wish to believe already. Divide and conquer style, they set people against each other, and the truth may be somewhere in the middle perhaps, but just far enough away from each bandwagon that neither side is able to hear the other no matter however hard they shout and block each other like immature idiots. And such is the joy of the polarization that is a deliberate thing probably where everyone just behaves hyper-religiously on everything. Every facet of life has to be a oh you don't like this then you're not a real human you don't like that, you're not this, you're not, uh, you know, no true Scotsman, all that kind of stuff. It's just always witch hunting, always treating each other badly because no one has ears anymore. And anyone with eyes is treated badly by those who love to be blind. Anyway, take care everyone and try not to go crazy.